a brightly colored face mask that's going to solve all of my complexion problems, I'm skeptical. And that's why I'm yelling because I was advertised this product from Asari on Instagram and it's saying that I can skip makeup forever once I use this a few times. So we're gonna dive into that ad because as I said, I'm a truth seeker and I'm gonna try this product out and we're gonna see if it was worth our money and another skincare for <laughs> and another skincare focused installment of trying Instagram products. Hello television viewers, my name is Nick. Thank you so much for joining me once again on my channel for another installment of Trying Instagram Products. This is the playlist where I pick up one of those items you see advertised all the time in your Instagram and social media feeds. That way we can get it home and try it out to see how much we like it. To see if it's worth our time and our money and our effort and every little piece of our soul that we put into it. I believe that when we go out in the world, we release a strand of our essence. And I want to make sure every product is worth my essence strand. So that's why today we're gonna pop this guy open and see what it's like. But first, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you wanna see even more trying Instagram products. That helps me out and lets me know what you wanna see. Ah! I've been balancing my phone on my lap precariously this whole time, so I deserve that. My phone is shattering every day, bit by bit. It's okay, soon it'll just be a piece of dust in my hand. Most importantly, if you're new to my channel, I would love to have you click that subscribe button. It looks like that right over there, that way you never miss new videos from me. I upload two new ones every week. Make sure you turn on all your notifications if you really want to ensure. Full delivery, baby. UPS every day. I have zero makeup on my face, obviously, because I'm going to put a face mask on. But first, let me show you the ad that inspired this whole purchase. That's important to me, that you get inside my brain. So you see where I'm at when I'm wasting my money on this stuff, you know? Because the ad makes it look like it's going to be really effective, like all of these ads do. Have you heard of this brand? before let me know in the comments why can I never find it when I need it Oh, here we go. Join the others ditching foundation. So it's all about brightening your skin and making it so you can go makeup free. I love the color of this, heaven in a bottle. So apparently lots of people are loving this. It's called the Earth Tones Mask, Australian Red Clay Brightening and Detox. And when I take the tube out, ooh, it's in one of those metal foil tubes. So, you know, it'll start to get crinkly as you squeeze it out. The brand sells this like turnkey for it. Do you see? See, they have like a little key that you can use to turn it and it was like $8 and I really should have got it because now I wish I had it. It looks so cool. I need that piece of plastic. Asari, Asari, Asari. The brand is called Asari. I'll spell it out for you on screen in case you're not getting it. A-S-A-R-A-I. Don't say it wrong, just read that and be right. <laughs> Asari, I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name, but can I have one of those keys? Sometimes all you have to do is ask. Anyway, I think you could see why this mask is making a lot of big promises and I just had to get it. It cost about $35. You can get it on a subscription plan if you want to, but I say let's try it out first. Fragrance free, toxin free, ethical, health, safety, mother earth, the sky, the rain, the waters of the ocean. It all flows through me. I relate to that. Not tested on animals natural product organic ingredients that's all I need to hear how much do you love piercing like the metal cap on stuff like this one of my favorite simple joys in life yes ooh there's a little hint at the red clay goodness that's capped inside so full of life earth what is life earth you ask <laughs> you don't you wish you knew if only you knew all right let's get a little bit of the product on the fingertip it's just this rich, deep red color that I love. Very red clay color. Let's get a little on the face. Oh, yes, that's so beautiful. Do you not love that red brick, that red brick color? <laughs> Oh, I look like I've been beat in the face a little bit. It's graphic, it's bold, it's everything you want to be for summer 2019. The ingredients I read through this are very good. I'm, as of like this year, really done with a lot of senseless nonsense filler ingredients that I've been seeing. Like I'll still use my old favorites that contain who knows what, but when I'm seeking out new products, it really is important to me now to buy things that are mostly natural or all natural. Naturally, the camera doesn't want to 
to focus on my red, red face. There we go. Look at my fingertips. They're also red. Can you imagine? They're the same color. All skin types. Use it two to three times per week, it says on this bottle. Let's get my forehead covered up and taken care of. I feel like my skin has been very under control lately, and that makes me happy. I've been getting some compliments. Not to brag, but also I'm bragging. But you asked, you know, like, I wouldn't have brought it up, but you asked me to make this video about this product that I chose. You asked me to do that. So don't blame me when I'm talking about myself all the time. I'm just doing what I said I would do, which is anything I want. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> Let's swoop some under the lip area and really get full coverage on the whole face. Why do I skip that part of my head like I don't get big gap in my hairline there? Duh. Stop putting mask only where your hair was at age seven. Put it where it is. Cover your whole face as of age 30. Don't lie to yourself. P.S. I'm not 30 yet. I'm 28. I'm not trying to prematurely age myself. I'm full of youth because of this beautiful red mask. And you wish you knew the other secrets of my beauty routine, but you can can't have them until I publish my novel called Bathing in Miracles. <laughs> Why am I talking so much today? Because this is really fun to put on. <laughs> Do you love the full red scare of it all? <laughs> Ooh, layering it on luxuriously. Uh, uh, uh. Don't forget your crevices of your nose, Nicholas. Those are important. How long should I leave this on for? Now, I'm pretty sure I got my whole face covered without even squeezing that tube, so I'm feeling pretty good about the size of this. Oh, really generously sized. I don't think I would need this delivered on a monthly basis, but hey, maybe you use it a lot. Okay, let me go rinse off the cap here. I'll be right back. Hello, Instagram. I'm willing to give it all in the name of beauty and I invite you to join me. Hello, Instagram. I'm willing. That's all the sneak peek they need. Why did I do this? Someone explain that to me. Oh well. Oh, good. This camera still doesn't want to focus on me. That's fun. There's nothing to see here anyway. Just a crazy red face. You can't say red face, right? Probably not. Probably shouldn't say that. Well, the mask is really nice in that it stays this beautiful red color even as it dries. I thought it would turn into this like grayish red, but no, it's still really beautiful. I love this rich red color. That's probably my favorite part about it so far. Let's wipe it off though and see how we like it. I've got a microfiber towel. I love big long head towels like this because they can take off masks really quick. You just hold it on, let it melt a little bit of that mask, and then you shimmy, shimmy, shimmy it around. Ooh, that comes off nice and clean, doesn't it? Ah, uh, halfway there, daddy. Oh, no, why did I say that? <laughs> Ooh, clear, bright skin revealed underneath. Look, I look like one of Gem in the holograms, don't I? Let's clean up this line. We can make this really artistic. Yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Let's do something like that. Mm, yeah. There's a shape we can deal with. How's my skin look underneath? Brighter, happier, more cheerful, ready for Christmas? Mm-mm, mm. -mm. mm. Mm-mm-mm. Ha! Beautiful. Get off the last remnants there. That felt really good. It has a very unfragranced fragrance, you know? I have other clay masks that are also unfragranced and it just kind of has that vague or that kind of faint earth smell which is not at all like dirt or unclean. It feels very good on the skin. And it smells clean too. Beautiful. What do you think, guys? I feel like I should get a mirror so that I can tell you how my skin looks, and then we will debrief. Mm-hmm. My skin looks very calm and even-toned. Now, I know that you're not going to see the full results of using a mask um, one single time, but I like to always get a sense of how my skin looks and feels right afterwards because that can often tell you a good amount about how it's gonna work for you in the future, I think. You don't want your skin to feel tight or look dry in any way afterwards, and just Generally, if I've used a really nice, healthy, natural product, there's a translucency to my skin that I can pick up right after using a product where it's like, oh, things look less red. Because generally, I carry a lot of rosiness and I can tell when it's dropped off a little bit. I can see where the skin is red from having mm, rubbed it recently. And then underneath, it's like much more neutral. Mm, I love a nice masking session, don't you? Currently, I'm using another Dead Sea mask from Pure Body Naturals. I'll leave a link to 
of those and this in the description below. But I'm always trying to switch it up. I wouldn't have gotten red clay all over me if I hadn't like hugged that towel to my body so closely after I had wiped off the mask. But that's maybe one thing to look out for. Don't get it on your clothes or you'll have to put them in the laundry. Otherwise, I'm really happy to have this nice, really beautiful mask to put into the lineup with the other mask that I use regularly because I think that it'll be rather interchangeable. They're both a clay-based mask and this one just feels really good. I also love that this is an Australian brand and I'm such a horse girl for Australia. I love Australia. <laughs> like, I've never even been to Australia, but I'm like, what if we talked about Australia for a minute? So, I think it's cool that this is an Australian brand. It's like, oh, I sent money to Australia and then Australia sent something back to me. Ha! <laughs> Easily impressed. But yes, I'm loving the results of this mask so far and I'm excited to see how they go over time. You can continue to follow my skincare journey right here on my channel, but you're gonna also want to follow me on Instagram for some of that, so just stay in the loop. You know what I'm talking about if you really want the full scoop? But I know my next thing is I have to get that turnkey for this because I want to get every last drop of this mask out before I spend 30 bucks on another batch. Although it does seem like it's worth the price because I used just a tiny little amount. You saw how little went onto my face that time. So all in all, I give this Asari mask a big thumbs up. I am super excited to incorporate this into my skincare routine and not everything that I purchased off Instagram I can say that about for sure. So I'm also loving the packaging. Let's give a quick shout out to how beautiful that's going to look on my pink, white, and that matcha green skincare color that all of my products seem to have right now. This is a bold choice. Love it! What do you guys think of this mask? Would you pick it up? You can try it for yourself if you check out the links in the description below, but let me know in the comments your thoughts. Also, give this video a big thumbs up if you want to see even more episodes of trying Instagram products. And if you're new to my channel, or if you're not new and you're just late to pressing the button, you should really try clicking that subscribe button. It looks like that right over here. That way you never miss new videos from me. Again, notifications on so that you get notified twice a week when I give you new videos. They're not always at the same time. I'm sorry that I can't get it together like that, but hitting subscribe will just make sure you never miss them. So I'm so thoughtful. Thank you guys all for getting even skin with Asari with me today. I will see you next time.